Hello, my name is Dr. Catherine Sisoyeva and I'm here today to talk to you about college admissions and the value of college counseling. I think that this is invaluable. Um, when you are working with somebody who has gone through the entire U.S. educational system and has gone through to its top tier universities, then you're accessing people who um, have the knowledge of what it takes to compete in the system, of what colleges and universities are looking for from an applicant, of what kinds of extracurricular study you need to be involved in, what kind of courses you need to be taking, what kind of research you need to do. If you're working with people who don't have that background, how can they guide you through to achieving your dreams? Well, I think first of all that Zafir High School students have an extraordinary opportunity both in the high school that they're attending, in the English classes that give them preparation to go on to study in English if they choose, um, and in the facilities that they have. So my goal for the students here is to open up the doors of opportunity to colleges and universities, not just in the U.S., but also through Dream Break, uh, to colleges and universities in Europe. And my goal is to take those students and help them define their own dreams, set them on a path that's going to allow them to clearly articulate a path forward, developing their interests, deepening their abilities, honing in on their strengths, and then open up the future to them. I think that there's a number of people that students need to work with along the way. I think that in the educational system, mentorship is crucial. And so as you're preparing for college, you need uh, mentors who can guide you in planning out your courses. You need mentors who can advise you in your extracurricular activities. As you move into extracurricular study and research, then you need people at the top academic levels who can help to guide that research so that you're getting real value out of what you're doing and you're working to your fullest potential. And then as you're moving forward and you're starting the college application process, you need to work with a college counselor and with a strategist who can really advise you on the best college fits for you based on your profile, based on your interest, and based on your ambitions. And then you need guidance, of course, along the way in writing your college essays. Yes, so the primary difference between the APs and any other upper level system is simply that that is the most highly recognized advanced high school preparation in the United States. So if you're aiming for a U.S. college, then taking AP, AP courses is really to your advantage. Now the IB system is also widely recognized, but if there are courses that are not available to you in an IB program, that are available to you at the AP level, then you should be lining yourself up to take those AP courses. Other advanced level courses that might be offered within the Turkish system simply won't have the same credentialization in our U.S. educational system. So even if you worked at a very high level, you won't get the academic recognition that you might be looking for. 